What's up everyone? I'm Ruben, here with Rolly, and I'm gonna give you a quick overview of Rolly Studio Drums, the world's first desktop MPE synth for drums and percussion. Rolly Studio Drums comes free with all Rolly hardware, and it takes full advantage of their expressive and customizable capabilities. Rolly Studio Drums is now bundled with Rolly Studio Player, so all you have to do is download Rolly Studio through Rolly Connect, and both plugins will be installed. All right, let's try making a beat. You can use Rolly Studio Drums as a standalone app or open it as a plugin inside your DAW. I'll be building my track in Bitwig Studio, where I've already got some chords and melodies that I laid down with Rolly Studio Player. I'll be controlling my software with two light pad blocks and a live block. Although Rolly Studio Drums was designed for the light pad block, you could also play drums on the surface of the Seaboard block if you like. All right, let's start by finding the right sounds. Rolly Studio Drums comes with a collection of expressive drum parts. There's both sample-based and synthesized options for kicks, snares, hats, toms, cymbals, and more. You can browse preset kits, or you can build your own custom kit by combining individual drum parts. Let's check out the Electro Chill Pop kit. When you choose a kit, the sounds are laid out in a 4x4 grid. Each type of drum part is a different color. For example, kicks are pink, snares are purple, cymbals are yellow, etc. These colors are also reflected on the surface of the light pad block, so you can easily remember the locations. All right, let's try out this kit. So far, I've been playing these drum sounds in the same way that I might with a traditional pad controller. But the really innovative aspect of Rolly Studio Drums is that it takes advantage of the light pad's responsive surface to let you manipulate parameters on the fly using multi-dimensional gestures. For example, listen to what I can do with this hi-hat sound. If I slide up, I can initiate a note repeat. And if I glide left to right, I can change the rhythm of that note repeat. I can save so much time normally spent drawing in all those hi-hat rolls of the mouse or dragging around automation lines. Plus, it's just much more intuitive to have physical control. Let's check out a couple more of these sounds. This kick, for example, if I glide to the right, I can extend the bass sound. or the cymbal sound. I can bend the pitch in one direction or create a note repeat in the other direction. The combination of Rolly Studio drums and the five dimensions of touch on the light pad means I can use new physical gestures for inspiration and to enhance my production. All right, let's try it out. Now let's take a look at adjusting the sound of the drum parts in my kit. Every drum part has three macros to experiment with. I can even assign a light pad block to control these faders through hardware control. And remember, if you want any hardware to stay in control even after you close the plugin window, you can just click this lock icon. Let's see what we can do with this kick sound. It's a nice subdued kick, but what would happen if we increase the decay? Nice. All right, now let's take a look at this side stick sound. We can change the tone, the tune, 
and even the reverb. Okay, so I really like the default kick and clap sounds from this kit, but I kind of wish my hi-hat had sharper transients so it could cut through the mix a bit better. Fortunately, I can build my own custom kit. Let's see, I can filter the sounds to look at only the hi-hats. Let's try replacing the pop closed hat two with the trap hard hat one. Great. Okay, now let's go back to that drum part that we recorded earlier and maybe lay down one more layer with this shaker sound. And if you want to take your beat even further, Rolly Studio Drums also has an audio effects module. This module is great for trying out ideas on the fly. I can control them on the light pad block using the hardware control functionality. Now I have a perfect controller for these XY effects. In the single view, I've got plenty of space to really fine tune my effect. But in the multi view, I can control four different effects presets simultaneously. Right now I've got reverb, distortion, filter, and delay, but I can always swap these out with another preset from the list. Let's try messing around with some of these effects, and I could even record them as automation if I wanted to. As you can see, Rolly Studio Drums is an innovative and streamlined way to create unique drum parts for your tracks, especially when you're using a light pad block as your controller. So try it out for yourself and see where it takes you. <laughs>